there is life outside your apartment. I know it's hard to conceive, but there's life outside your apartment. And you're only gonna see it if you leave. There is cool shit to... Hey guys, welcome back to Rhapsody. Last time we were in um, the palace because dance and all that other stuff. And uh, apparently it's about time for the prince to get kidnapped. My own thoughts. Oh, poor dragon. Uh, now it's all the witches just talking. Um, sorry if I'm moving a little fast through the dialogue. This is the second time that I've tried to uh, record this. And uh, in all truth... Yeah, it just kind of happens, and look at that animation for that sprite. I mean, sheesh. They spared no expense on the jiggle, uh, jiggle physics for her. She's wearing nothing but underwear. <laughs> just look at her jiggle. I mean, honestly, that's that's all you need to do is look at her jiggle. The rest of them, they blink, they just stand there, they're fine. Her, no, they had to definitely just give her everything. Also, I love the way that uh, Cornette doesn't, you know, speak up and say, Hey, <laughs> you know, say, hey, no, she was actually trying to rob me. And then she summoned a dragon, and bam, here it is. And Marjorie. Ah, uh, Marjorie. I know some of you have actually been noticing my D&D uh, &D stuff. If you like it, I'll put more up. But it's mainly there for uh, my friends who I actually play with. And if you guys want to play, just let me know. I can probably find a way to, uh... Well, I can't set up a server for, uh... For map tool or anything, so... Sorry, but... I can find a way to actually make a game. Oh, uh, yeah. She turned the prince to stone instead of actually trying to put him to sleep. Yeah... Sorry there's been a lo nothing but uh, actual, like, conversation in the past couple of them. Or past couple of episodes, I mean, that's... This game's a lot of just conversation. But the music makes it all worth it. <laughs> yeah, no, I wasn't gonna get in on that. Even though that's actually really fun. Whenever it actually does come up like that. Uh. <sighs> uh sorry, hasn't been the best day for me. I've been up for way too long today. And. Ah, uh, fuck. It's a supposed to lose fight! I really hate the supposed to lose fights. They suck. I can't get one more horn in, though. I mean, why not? I mean, it gets me up to three here. Instead of, uh... Instead of, you know, just two. Um, and you see how everything that we do is missing? That's because, well, it's a supposed to lose fight. They're not supposed to... I'm not supposed to be able to hit them. I'm not supposed to be able to damage them. Because if I do, then I'd be doing, like, one damage or they'd have to fudge everything. And, uh... Yeah. So I lost. Because I had to lose. Which sucks. Sucks big time.
Ha, ha, the oldest witch in the land. Makes the old maid comment even funnier. And if they could teleport, why bother with the dragon? I mean, honestly, that poor dragon crashed into a castle. No. No, it wasn't. It was not. And uh, coming up is actually exactly what I said. I'm going to be selling Elkin. Because, uh, yeah, he's done. His story arc is over. He is no longer contributing anything to the plot. So there's no reason to keep him around, especially whenever he doesn't do much for me in the grand scheme of things. Uh. And so here's where the story begins in earnest. Cornet is off to save the prince. Yeah, I've been playing nothing but the prologue so far. Haha! <laughs> These sprites are really, really good. Yay, Karuru's coming with me because Karuru's a very, very good friend. Even though I already know Karuru's probably gonna die. Poor Karuru. And here is the new outfit that I've been waiting for the entire game. And of course I gotta check the bed and everything else. And nothing so, time to leave. Bye Grandpa! Bye Grandpa! Fuck you Karu. why must you ruin everything? It's supposed to be my big surprise to break. Tower of Wisdom and Blue Cat. Gotcha. Thank you, Grandpa. I'm gonna leave, then. If I ever need anything, I know where you're at. I hate it whenever characters do that, and it's just... Aww. No wonder I'm so old. Guru, look after her. Stereotypical! Stereotypical anime is stereotypical. Yeah, why not read the fan club letter? I mean, honestly. This game has a lot of nice little fluff in it. I mean, really. And now you just keep going around, and, uh, yeah. Uh, should have looked at the notice. Oh, well. Doesn't matter. Let's go to Mother Green. The ancient forest is where the Chimera is, and that's where I'm going to be losing three monsters at once, or three puppets at once. So I've got to wait until I get uh, Kid and Billy's brother. Which I think is in Blue Cat or Snow White, one of the two. Okay, now I'm um, going to be honest. I have no idea where I'm going. So I'm just going to check around and uh, yeah... Okay. Yeah, you just want to see where the... Talk to me? Yeah, fuck yeah. Okay. I'm looking to see where the harbor is, if there is a harbor that I can get to. Uh, no, not around here. Down there? No. 
Okay, uh, I remember there was a harbor over... Uh, can't get there because of these boxes. So I guess I gotta go in the restaurant. Um, now let's talk to every single person in the restaurant. Every single person. Alright. Uh huh. Thank you. Uh huh. Ow. Uh, Atoyel. Okay. I should probably go check on Atoyel. Uh huh. If I can see the Tower of Wisdom. Yeah, really. You're a pervert. Um. Yeah. Okay. Time to say goodbye to Elkin. Goodbye, Elkin. Thanks for the Etonium. Some of you guys are going to be like, You should have kept him around! He was electric type! I don't care. I shouldn't have kept him around because his entire story arc is over. And yes, I am going to be trying to do as many puppet story arcs as I can. Depending on who I find and what their story is. And, uh, yeah, so let's keep going. But once a puppet has reached its limit, well, it's time to l uh, let them go and sell them. And it's gonna be really, really sad to say goodbye to Tell and Billy. El Toyel is stuck up in a room. <sighs> Long day. The toil's not even in her room. Do you know where a toil's at? You didn't even change your uh, speech. Okay, well, I'm probably not going to find anything in this part of the castle, but I may as well check. This is the part of an RPG that everybody loves. Walking around through every single room, talking to people to find out, where the fuck do I go? <laughs> Even I kind of like it, but at the same time... Yeah, it gets a little tedious from time to time. I understand. The next time I actually go through all of this... I'm just gonna leave it out and... Okay, down here, over here, uh, up, all uh, right, this is the Atlas room. <sighs> Stupid sticky controls in this game. Uh, over here? Nope, nothing over here. Going back through this room, check what it says about the hole. Yeah, they did. Yes, it is. Okay, uh, go up. Can I talk to the queen? I mean, future mother-in-law? Nah. No, you wouldn't. Well, what a big help you are. Uh, I'm not necessarily just public, you know. Uh, let's see if there's anybody in the tower or anywhere else that I can go that just said it kind of helps. Fuck you too. 
Uh, okay. Time to leave the entire castle because no one's helpful here. <sighs> Why does everybody have to be so fucking stupid? Okay, which house am I supposed to... Captain Ship, okay. Who's the captain? Okay. There used to be such a piece... Okay. Do you know that there's a spell... What? Alright. Oh! Hi! You must be the captain. Oh, uh, her boyfriend's an asshole. Yeah, I'll help you. Oh god, not dogs! I'm leaving my battleship, uh, boat. Yes, I want to go to Blue Cat. What kind of question? Ah. Uh, what a woman. Huh. Well, I guess I'm going to Natalie River, and that means that uh, we'll take it from here next time. I'm Thelman23. See you later.